Hi, this is Rob Butler. I'm here today to show you how to play Seasons of Wither by Aerosmith. It's off the Get Your Wings record. It's a really great song. It's one of my favorite cuts off that, uh, that album. And it starts off and ends with the same pattern. It starts with a guitar moving from G to B flat, G to A, and then it's hitting some open strings through the open D and the G. It's based off the G minor scale, which it, it's hitting the G, it's hitting the B flat, which is the minor third, and it's hitting the second. It's also hitting the fifth and back to the, the, the root note again, an octave higher. So the pattern goes like this. goes and it ends on the D and once it gets to the D it hits a rhythm pattern that uh, is kind of power corded you can play open chords um, you can play them in different positions but it goes from D to C D to C D to C then the D send goes D C B flat F and it sounds like this to the F. Then it kicks into the, the verse, which is what Steven Tyler's singing over. And then it goes to like a pre-chorus. So I'll kind of walk you through that. So at the end of that, you could have played it up here. Or you could have played open chords. recommend that for that F chord but uh, you know it's a big full sounding chord but uh, anyway those are the the chords involved D major C major B flat major and F major or you can play fives fifths are just the root note of the fifth like That's how that goes. So then the, the vocal piece comes in, and that's where he's pivoting off the open E, goes up to the F, goes to the F sharp and the G. It just repeats, and it goes like this. stays on that G for a couple of measures. Before it does the walk down from C major 7 to B to that open E. And that next part goes... repeats that second verse the same thing so the breakdown of that that verse is so you hit the open E so you hit that open 
open E twice. And you come down and hit the A note on the G string second fret. Then you hit the D and the G. Then you hit the F. It's the same thing, but you just hit the F note as the drone walking up. Then you hit the F sharp. You hit the D to, D to A, and then you. Then the G, and it rides that G for two measures. Then it goes. You know, it just repeats that verse. They play it four times, and on the fourth one, they hang on that G for two measures. Then the next part. finger second note is the D is the E on the second fret D string let you strum all five strings you want to bring out then you hit the B note I play G5, you could play a G major. It just goes from G to A, which is the fifth position, um, sixth position, which is the B flat, then over to the C major, and it slides into the D major. Then back to that, that power chording. That's pretty much it. Um, those are the four parts of that song. Great song. Give it a listen, work on it, and have fun with it. Thank you.